just got my box from Italy, so I'm going to open it up and see what's inside. It looks kind of small, so I don't know. I hope everything is in here. Pretty cool so far. Oh. So, here's the first doll. Her box looks like it got a little crushed, just a little bit, which is not really very good. She looks pretty interesting. These dolls have a lot of a different style than the other ones. Sailor Mars, of course. Pretty cool. I do think that the hair on the doll is very interesting. It looks kind of like a dark purple, which is kind of interesting. I've never seen that before for a Sailor Mars doll. It might be a little difficult to tell that it's kind of a purpley color, but if you look kind of against the pink, you can kind of tell that it is not black, it is purple. I like the outfits a lot. I think that those are really cool. It's kind of like a shiny, glittery looking skirt. Uh, the pleats in the skirt, the little lines are all really pronounced. Sometimes when they make these dolls, they have really loose, fluffy kind of skirts. And this doll has very tight pleats. Um, the bow also looks very nice, I think. I like the shininess of the doll. The eyes, I think, are very cool. Um, I know a lot of people have not really cared much for these Italian dolls um, because they look so different than the other ones that we're already used to in this country. Uh, they look a little more cartoony, and a lot of people have not really cared for that look. I think that it fits the show very well and looks really nice. So I got like a bunch of different things. We'll look at one of the oh that's actually the wand which looks kind of small but it's the same exact mold of the old wand. I really like the box a lot. I think it's really cool. Um, in case I hadn't mentioned before in this video, what this stuff is, is, um, Sailor Moon is playing again in Italy, but not in the United States yet, and these are the new toys that they have in Italy, uh, which you can only get if you order online, which I have the link to the site that you can order them from if you're interested, but they are all very cool. I especially like the packaging of this box. I think the pink looks really nice. I like what they did with it. I think it's very pretty. And I hope that when they bring these things over to America that they keep it nice and pink. I like it a lot. It's just everything is in Italian. The box came from Italy. It's all imported. But it is uh, very, very cool. Very cool. I think it's very nice. So I'll put her over there with Sailor Mars and pull some more stuff out of the box. This is a magazine and also the Luna Pen, which came with the magazine. It's um, it seems like it's just like a magazine that you buy in Italy of Sailor Moon and. Um, this is not part of it. This, um, when you buy the magazine, I guess they give you 
like a free gift in Italy when you buy the Sailor Moon magazine. And I don't know what you got for the, the first one because I did not see that for sale on the website or anywhere else. Um, but the second one came with the Luna pen. So this is actually just a free kind of gift. It's a freebie gift for if you buy the magazine. Again, you can buy this on that website with all the other imported stuff. Uh, this is really cool. I know I've already seen a few people make videos on YouTube with this. Um, I'm told that you can break it apart kind of about here and it's like a pen and uh, that you can actually use to write with. And at the top, the little jewel opens up and you can use the lip gloss that's inside of the jewel. So it's kind of different and interesting, I think. Um, the magazine is uh, really very nice looking. The pictures are really cool. Uh, it is all in Italian. So, you know, if you don't read Spanish, which is kind of close, or Italian, you're probably not going to understand, but, uh, you know, pretty cool. I think it's always really funny they call Tuxedo Mask or Darien Milord. I don't know why. But um, the magazine is really nice looking. I really like it a lot. It has nice pictures. So that'll be really cool to look at. And um, I also got the Italian CD. This was the last one on the website when I looked. Uh, maybe they will get more and you can get one too if you want one. Uh, it's really cool. It's got all the Italian theme songs for the Sailor Moon show in Italian. Plus a dance remix. Then I got a, of course, a Sailor Venus doll to go with Sailor Mars. She also looks really cool. The hair is like a really bright, vibrant yellow. So we'll put her over there. And Sailor Moon. Again, very, very bright, vibrant yellow hair. Very interesting. They actually did put Odongos on this doll. They normally just put like red little snappy things on a Sailor Moon doll. They don't normally actually make real Odongos, little meatballs, but they made real hair meatballs on this doll. Very interesting. Um, her hair is right on. She does look a little strange, but very cool. Very cool doll. So I'll put her over here. And then I think that looks like it's an order form. That right now. Uh, here is the Sailor Jupiter doll. Oh, I really like her hair. Look at that. It's really cool looking. Um, I like the big curly piece coming out of her hair, like uh, by her ears. The hair looks like a very curly kind of reddish brown ponytail. Her hair looks very reddish. I like this doll a lot. I think this is one of the better looking of these ones. I think she looks really nice. Sailor Jupiter does. She looks really good. So, very nice. Pretty doll. Very pretty hair. Really nice. And the last doll that I've got, which is Sailor Mercury, which I think that this doll is a very interesting Sailor Mercury doll. I think her face is very pretty. I really, I don't know why, I just really like this this doll. Her hair looks kind of strange. It looks a little big. Um, it's pretty fluffy and large. Uh, if I open these, I might, um, I haven't decided whether I'm going to do that or not yet, but if I do open them, I will probably try to fix her afro a little bit. Or it looks kind of, kind of wild in there, but a really cool doll. And then the last thing, which is actually the thing I'm most excited about, uh, when I was a kid, my dad was in the army and we lived in, uh, we lived in Europe for a little while, and I always had these really nice Clementoni puzzles. Uh, and what they are is they're just, they're really nice, like an Italian brand of puzzle, 
And that's what this is. It's a an official Sailor Moon jigsaw puzzle. And these are really nice. They have very hard, strong pieces that are very good. They're very high quality. The boxes are very hard and very nice. The picture on this particular one is very nice. You know, I really like that it features all the villains from the first season. I think that's really cool. Jedi, Nephlite, Queen Beryl, Malachite, Zoicite. Very cool. And then it's got a really nice image of Sailor Moon in the middle. So I think that this looks really cool. It's only 104 pieces, so I'm probably not really going to be using it. But it is still a really nice thing to have in my Sailor Moon collection, especially since I am a big, big fan of jigsaw puzzles. And these are one of the best you can get. Ravensburger and Clementoni, pretty much some of the most high quality puzzles that you're really going to see. Um, there is one more puzzle that I got. And I don't like the image on this one as much as the other one, but this was the only 250 piece puzzle that they had. Um, they have one other one on the website, which I did not order because I didn't want to go too crazy. But um, this one is also really nice. It's got a lot of really nice images of the scouts. And I'm just a really big fan of jigsaw puzzles. It's also got them in their school uniforms, which is just really nice looking. I really like the picture a lot. I like the pink on the box. I like, it just looks really nice. These puzzles are just really, really nice puzzles. So that is all of the things that I got from my order from Italy. It came from a store in Messina called, um, well, the guy online, his, wife, his website is called Muscara, M-U-S-C-A-R-A dot com. And uh, it is a very good website for ordering the imported Italian Sailor Moon things. So these are, again, all of the nice things that I got from Italy. And here are all of the dolls, just one last time. It all looks very good, and I'm really happy about it. So I hope you enjoyed my video. If you have any questions uh, about any of the things that you see, uh, please let me know, and I will try my best to answer them. There should be a link below if you want to buy these things. The new Sailor Moon 2011 Italian items.